Hello family, my name is John Obatan, a YouTuber from Uganda, Kampala, Uganda. I make videos that you don't see on TV. And today I'm here with my family. They are going to introduce themselves one by one. I'm starting with your favorite girl. Come on, Harris and Abo right here. Please be sure to subscribe to my channel. I love you. Yes. <laughs> Guys, African Yako. Yeah, please subscribe to my channel. My channel too. Come and subscribe to African Yako. See you. <laughs> yes, Uncle Bakwash to the world. Please subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to the channel of Batang. Joel Obatang. Joel Obatang. The man himself. Pakwash to the world. Thank yes. you very much. And I am here, Nalongo Leticia. Please subscribe to Joel Obatang YouTube channel and come here. Please subscribe to Nalongo Leticia YouTube channel. So yeah. You guys, we are going to be giving you so much of uh, how Kapala looks like. So many more videos are coming up. So as you are here, Please watch out for many more other videos, but please subscribe. Don't forget, you just watch and you don't subscribe. Always subscribe. Okay. So that's uh, Entebbe Road, the flyover. That's how it can see a lot of traffic, high traffic. So this one is called, I'm not sure about the place, but then this guy is going to tell us more about this place. Yes. Yo, yo. Yo, I'm one. Yo, yo. man. My name is Joel Abatan. A YouTuber from Kampala, Uganda. I make videos on TV. You can go and check me out. Have a good day. Thank you, bro. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yes. That's the <laughs> uh, Did you guys miss me? They missed you. The last time you saw me on Jolly's channel was, I don't know when, yeah. but now I was in Western Uganda, but now I'm back to the city. Yeah, I hope you, you guys go and check our videos about Western Uganda. They are yeah. so nice. She was selfish. She left me alone. <laughs> <laughs> she left me alone. I'm eh? really yeah, but also, also we also get to support us and we get nice content from Kampala here. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> eh? Okay, guys, let's give you a safety tour with yeah. some amazing content creators. Yes. Please be sure to subscribe. Okay, okay? please. Eh? Now, this guy is struggling to, to, to enter. To enter, yeah. They are struggling to enter. Actually, they change their money. Here. Yes. They charge you money. Yeah, because their exit and entries are all closed. They are working they are fried over. So these people are getting advantage. You know Uganda. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, after after that. Yeah. So this this what's the name of this place actually? Maybe it's a shop right, but since that's a shop right is not working. If you want to meet anyone, just no, the name of the shop, shop, right. shop right was was here. But now it is closed. No, like the name of the place. Uh, so let me try but then it's well known for the shop right the, the, yes, that's yes. the place so guys if you know the name of this place you can let us know okay guys welcome at back because we're going to give you everyday yes. content yes. non-stop mm. daily then we go to other countries we are going to move all over the world all over the world I think our dream is traveling all over the world showing you so please guys you should support us they should also throw some dollars okay yes non refundable money non -refundable. african nyakos you girl them you got any beauty and uncle papa to the world is there they got any beauty that you don't see on tv <laughs> 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 so this is the exit. This actually what's the name of the place? Shop right. Former shop right. Former shop right. Everyone is calling former shop right. Let's go by that. I thought shop right left. Yeah, they left but the names the name stuck around. Shop right. Okay, most business close of course during during COVID. Yes. Yeah, but I think most of those names, once they get used to it, people don't like changing. Yes, because I, mean, I, mean, I was trying to look for the, the indigenous name for that. This is Nachibubu, I think. 
when I was growing up in this country. Let me let you say this area. Oh, so me, I'm stuck at Nakivo Stadium. Hey, we grew up all of this area. We grew up from this side. No, when I was when I was young, we used to be used to cars. Oh, all those shop rides were not there. Oh, shop rides, games, they're not there. Okay. Yeah. Yes, so guys, this is an old tax park. Here there are many vehicles that lead you to different places. As you see, that's congestion. You can see popcorn guy over there. Go. Just stop, eh? Let me put it in. Go. The, the zip, eh? Hmm? The, the she zip. has no zip. Oh, but it's because of your zip. So this is a tax park. Here you find cars that lead you to different places where you're going. You can see how congested it is. A tax park that you don't see on TV. My name is Joe Obatan. So here, different prices. All here. Is a new, is an old tax park which was renovated in 2000. When was this renovated? Around COVID time, eh? Yeah, this during, is, during COVID 2021. That's when the innovation of this tax park. So, how is your impression about this tax park? Uh, like I told you, mm. I left the city some time back. Yes. So now coming back, finding like this is more organized. Yes. The view it might look so different, but this now a more organized taxi park compared to how compared, it was before. Uh, compared to it, had so 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 many portals. Yes. But now I can see it's all neat. Yes. Compared to these caveras you see around. Oh. It's neat out. Yeah. Oh. The pavements. Oh. Yeah. So it's so, much much better compared to back then. So these caveras are due to because it's on a weekend. Yeah, but, but, I, but I'm sure they clean them. They clean them during normal days so these guys are having fun. You call it to fight it, but it's fun here. Eh? Yo. Yeah, yeah. Those are vendors. So if these people, mm. they always fight around with the authorities, capacity authorities. Ah. Uh, so they are always on like study a lot. When they come, they have to run with them. Yeah. So this one, are there in Pakwaj, the fruits? Yeah, yeah, those are very common. Uh, yeah, the the genus. Yeah, those yeah. are very common. That's the tax part. From this angle, the slave queens of Kampala, you find them around here. So this is a nine motorized -like corridor. Yeah. Guys, no, they, they will have to obey rules. Those are, those are breaking rules. Breaking rules, they'll have to obey because this is a non motorized corridor. There they come. There they come, breaking the rules. You see? Yeah. Only motorbikes, I mean, mot pardon me, only bicycles. bicycles are allowed here. So, guys, in case you're new here, my name is Joel Obatan, a YouTuber from Uganda. With Pakwach to the world. Yes. You can find, you see here, in case you're tired, you can come and relax. Have a chill. You can chill around and ask my subscribers to kindly subscribe to my channel, please, guys. Yeah, we are still. Walking walk, walk with these young, young people. <laughs> Uncle is guiding us on the life aspects. Yes, he's telling us how life should be. Do you know that people sleep up there? Do you know that? Hmm? People sleep there. Yeah, yeah, this is city, city what? City house. City house. The famous, this is where the old DP used to, to be. This used to be their headquarters. Oh. This was one of the one of the oldest, the first building since independence. Oh, city house. City house. Hmm? Oh. Uncle is telling us this is one of the first houses to be built now. Which friend just bought us bananas? You know, that is the good thing to move around the 
Brandy one. <laughs> so guys, this is the money. So this is five thousand Ugandan shillings, almost like two point five dollars. I'll leave the price down below in the video. Thank you. Okay. See you next time. Okay. Okay, guys. Let's proceed. Um, I think African Yapo and uh, Alpha Papa Shigawa. They're both Yes. Hi, boss. This one is red, eh? Yeah. Hey. Why? Why is red? Why is it red? Why is it red? This one is red. Okay, ah, uh, this one is ready. Ready. It's red. Where did they get their purple? Not sure, but it's red. Then the pineapple over there. Thank you, my rich friend, for buying us. Okay. Hey, hey. Hello. Joel Batan. Hi Joel, nice to see you. Nice to see you too. We are so lost, but we are doing a collaboration all of us together. Oh, yeah. That's the Mara Girls Festival. When is this going to be? 16th September. 16th September. Okay. So guys, if you are watching and you're coming from Naro Gorosha YouTube channel, please come and support this beautiful Ugana girl. And on 16th September, they are having a festival going on. African Yako, they are dancing. Can you guys dance? Yes, yes, we can. Yes. You want to Yes. We can give you the social medias and you follow them. Okay. Next time they are in my WhatsApp, okay? Yeah, I'm their content creator. Hey. Mara Girls, is that? The Mara Girls Festival by Richard Hart. Please repeat. Uh, you know Richard Hart? Yeah, Richard Hart. Richard Hart by Humphrey Larry Manga. Uh, yeah. So that the upcoming dancers. Yeah, they are people are there watching. They are going to perform there and they are also oh. promoting the festival. When are they going to perform? They are already superstars this time. All of them are big stars. Oh. Okay. Oh, nice. Nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you too. Nice oh, they look so cute. Thank you. <laughs> they are superstars, eh? Yeah, yeah they are the creators. Yeah. They are they're changing. Oh. Yeah, with dance. Oh. Yeah. They are like inspiring because all these street kids, they want to learn how to dance, but they are scared. Even me, I want to learn how to dance. Hey. What's that? Love. Hey, love. It means love. Yeah. Hey, okay. Let me take a picture. African Nyako is spectating. <laughs> <laughs> So that was our first president, Mutesa Wan. And we have a lot of banks in this place. We have uh, communication uh, organizations right there. We have big hotels like Imperial right there. Oh, nice. I love the fact that there is green everywhere. Like everywhere is green this side. Nice. And so organized compared to downtown. Hmm. Yeah. So let me give you uh, some history about Sir Edward Mutesa II, uh, who was the first president of the Republic of Uganda. You guys will know that we gained our independence in 1962. Yeah. So I don't know if you guys can see him, but that was our president of the Republic of Uganda. So this monument was put in between the cities so that we can remember him. Yeah. So let's proceed.